All right, guys, um, thanks for watching this Diagnostic World video. Uh, we're gonna be doing a demonstration of the Autel MS908 here. You can see on the dashboard here, we've got a lot of warning lights on this vehicle. It's a Mercedes C-Class. We've got the glow plug lights, the ABS light, the airbag light, uh, the pre-safe, uh, which is equal to the, um, the ABS and the ASP, with the run flat tire indicator coming on. With the traction warning light here uh, this is just relating to the handbrake which we've got on um, so we've got the uh, the VCI which is here hooked up to the diagnostic port and this is the kit itself this is the MS908 it is available at Diagnostic World it's www.diagnostic-world.com um, a bit tricky to, uh, to show you the video without getting glare on the screen so I'm gonna I'll try my best um, so we're gonna click into diagnostics uh, we're gonna select our vehicle so we need to find Benz which is here uh, just out of curiosity for you lots of other makes and models as well newly added uh, we've got Ferraris Aston Martins as well um, which previously were very difficult to get hold of um, so we're just going to click on to Benz and we're going to click manual selection so we're manually going to select uh, the vehicle first of all so we're going to go uh, C-Class it's a C-Class W204 So it's just establishing a connection with the uh, the vehicle's ECU. Just out of uh, incidental, I want to show you that the glow plug light has now gone off. Uh, generally what happens is the glow plug light comes on for about a minute or so when driving, then it turns itself off automatically. Um, but this kit will show us what is wrong with the, uh, the glow plug system. So we are right hand steering. It's a diesel engine and we are a 204-008-C220 CDI so diagnosis control unit um, what we'll do is first of all we'll go into the uh, the drive which is going to show us faults regarding the engine light and the glow plug so we we'll go to CDI motor electronics we'll come to the other faults as well the airbags and the ABS as well so we'll click read codes And it's telling us we've got quite a lot of codes actually um, so we've got a problem with the mass airflow meter that's a current fault exhaust gas recirculation actuator air intake se uh, temperature sensor pressure sensor so that's the MAF that's the EGR that's the MAP sensor um, one or more signals sent from control units ESP so that's with regards to the, uh, the sender the ABS and ESP which is coming on and then 228F is cylinder 4 glow plug so in this vehicle we know it's well used there are 173,000 miles on the clock we do know it needs a lot of maintenance to uh, sort of get it back on the road and get it up and running again uh, so it looks like we need a new MAF, a MAP sensor, EGR replacement or clean. Um, that will come to in a moment and cylinder 4 glow plug. It's best to just replace the whole lot of the, uh, the glow plugs. So that's with regards to the engine light and the glow plug light. Now what I want to do is go back and go into the chassis. And we'll click on to well we'll click on to ESP first of all and then we'll go to the adaptive brake. So the read codes in ESP. 
uh, component right rear axle has an electrical fault and plausible value from RPM so right rear axle sensor uh, sounds like the ABS sensor we'll just go into the adaptive brake which is probably going to reconfirm what what has already been said here no it's not communicating it must in, in this particular um, vehicle you must need to go in it in that that one there so that's fine though we've got the codes we need it's telling us it's an ABS fault with an ABS sensor and lastly to uh, get faults on the body which is relating to the airbag light we'll click on to SRS uh, read codes And here we go, three codes, uh, neck pro, head restraint, open circuit, drive, belt buckle, open circuit, squib, excessively high resistance. So it looks like a, a wiring or connection problem on the driver's side. Um, probably do with the connections underneath the driver's seat. But we'll get that checked out, that's not a problem. The main uh, purpose of this video really was just to show you the, uh, the Autel MS908 kit in action. Uh, it's a fantastic kit, it covers absolutely everything, every system in every vehicle. Uh, updates are so simple to do, they're just one touch. Uh, you would need a Wi-Fi connection, but as you can see it's quite a, quite a sturdy, well-made unit. And it covers absolutely every single system. Um, so, that's the uh, MS906, uh, sorry, 8. It is available at Diagnostic World. It's www.diagnostic-world.com or you can just click the link directly below this video. Thanks for watching and I hope this helps.